What's good, y'all? Hey, Zo, back with another video. Hope y'all enjoying y'all day out there right now. Sunset over here, you know what I'm saying? Cool little view. Today, this message right here, right here, for y'all, for me as well. We gotta be real with ourselves. Everybody not gonna make it. Everybody not gonna be there firsthand to witness us living our best life. And that's the truth. Some people in our life right now are not better than us. If anything, they're holding us back. And we gotta be real with ourselves. I'm talking to myself as well. Everybody in our life is not on what we on. Trying to improve ourselves, have a positive mindset, being successful. Everybody not on that. A lot of people cool, being around negative energy, having a pessimistic mindset, being around toxic people. They cool with that. And that's cool. Like I say, everybody should live their life how they want to live it. But everybody like me, they got a mindset like me, that want to be around positive, high vibrational people. We got to be real selective with people that's in our life. And we got to be real with ourselves. Some people not going to make it. They're not going to make the cut. They're not going to make the cut. I look at my life. I thought about this yesterday. We should look at our life as a winning basketball team. Everybody that come into the tryouts or come into our life can't make the team. They can't all make the cut. Just think about it. If everybody made the cut, the basketball team, or made the tryouts, the team would be some trash. The team would be some trash. People would be on the team shooting up air balls, can't dribble, don't got the right mindset, most importantly. Don't got the right mindset. Some people are gonna be on there complaining focusing on everything that's going wrong in the game instead of focusing on the bigger picture, getting their mind back focused on the game, better in their life, AKA. Everybody can't make the team. Everybody can't be in your life. So many people out here are cool with being in a pessimistic mindset. They're not aware how powerful their mind is. They're not aware that when they complain about their job, complain about their relationship, complain about their life in general, they're attracting more things to complain about. They're attracting more things to complain about. And yeah, we can share this knowledge with them. We can run about them, talk to them about it, tell them our experiences, but everybody's not gonna come around. Everybody's not gonna come around. And that's being real. Even if we love them, maybe they are day one, maybe they one of our closest cousins, you know, I ride or die. Are they really better in our life though? Or is it just attachment? Is it just attachment? You know? People in our life should be better than us. It should be motivating us. It should be pushing us to go harder. Not holding us back. It should be inspiring us in some way. You know? Whatever they're doing with their life, it should be motivating us to go harder. I remember Drake said in an interview not too long ago, he had an interview with, uh, I don't know who he was with, but he was talking about Lil Wayne. When he first met Wayne, and he was like, when he got on the track with Wayne, he knew he had to go hard. He knew he had to get better with his bars, with his lyrics. He knew he had to go hard in that song. And that's what our friends and people in our life should do. It should push us to go harder. You know, maybe we're not in the same niche. Cool. But if I see you going hard on a basketball court or in the weight room or just trying to improve your mindset, that's going to push me to go harder. Not no competition stuff, but just because I want to see you win and I want to be there with you winning, you know? If you're going to win, I want to be there with you winning. You know what I'm saying? People in our life should be motivating us, pushing us to go harder, to live our best life as well. Not holding us back. And we got to be real with ourselves. No matter how deep the attachment is, no matter how long we knew somebody, maybe we knew them since first grade. That don't mean we got to be friends forever. I was just looking at my Instagram feed yesterday or not too long ago. Yesterday or the other day or something like that. I was looking at my feed, right? And I was thinking like, why am I following you? Because I knew you in high school. Just because I knew you in high school don't mean I got to follow you for the rest of my life. Just because I knew you for a long time don't mean I got to know you for the rest of my life. I'm not the same person. We're not in high school no more. Just because I knew you for a long time don't mean you got to have access to me in my life. That's how I feel. We grown up now. We grown up now. We don't got to be friends with somebody we knew since first grade. I mean, we don't got to be your friends or follow them on social media if they're not on what we on then they're not then they're not, they're not better i can't even say the word then they're not better than us you know what i'm saying 
That's how I am with my life right now, man. I'm protecting my energy. I'm protecting my mindset. Energy is contagious. Mindsets are contagious. If you hang around people, or maybe you're in a relationship with somebody that's complaining all day, not making an effort. That's what matters to me, actually. That's what matters to me, making an effort. Make an effort to look on the bright side of things. Some people are just cool talking about the negative things of life. Make an effort, just make an effort. If you can make an effort, I'm cool with that. You can stay in my life. If you make an effort to talk more positive, speak about what you want instead of things that you don't want. If you can make the effort, cool. You can stay in my life. But most people don't even wanna make the effort. It feels good to them. Talk about negativity, having a pessimistic mindset. This feels good to them. They don't feel good to me no more. It used to be cool. It used to be entertaining. But I'm, I'm cool on that right now. I'm cool on that right now. I'm trying to talk about things I want for my future. I'm trying to live my best life. I'm trying to be successful. I'm trying to have a positive mindset. I'm trying to enjoy life. Like I say, enjoy the journey. That's what I'm on right now. I'm not trying to sit with you and complain. I had a mailman come up to me today complaining about the customer trying to rush us off the locker. Trying to put packages in the locker. And the customer was trying to rush me off the locker. Then after she left, and he was talking to me, like trying to complain about it. Like, they always trying to rush us off the locker. I'm like, bro, I don't even feel like complaining about it. She did what she did. I mean, she asked me to get off the locker. I said, when I'm done, I will. And then she was shut. And then she, I couldn't even say the word, bro. It's so cold out here. And then she stepped off. You know, I'm not about to complain with you. It is what it is. I'm moving on from it. I'm not about to sit here and talk about the same thing, complaining all day with you. I don't care that much. I don't care that much. Complaining only brings more things to complain about. So yeah, man, people that don't got the same mindset as you, trying to stay at a high vibration, have a positive mindset, be successful, and live their best life in general, everybody can't make it. Like the winning basketball team, everybody can't make the tryouts. Everybody can't make it. If they do, they're gonna slow you up. You're not gonna even make the championship. You're not gonna even live your best life. That's how I look at life right now, bro. That's how I was thinking about yesterday. Yeah, let me know your thoughts on this video. Be real with yourself, man. Be real with yourself. No matter how long you knew somebody, be real with yourself, man. Are they going to be there when you live your best life? Can they be a part of that life? Be real with yourself. That's something I'm going through right now and being real myself about, you know? Some people in my life right now, I got a question mark beside them. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just being real. I don't know. We're going to have to see, though. Let me know your thoughts on this video, man. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Instagram down below. I'm going to holler at y'all in the next one, man. Peace.